is Deion Sanders. Coach Braun has got this team off to a fantastic start, coming off a win over Alabama State that we talked about a little bit in the open, 26 to 12. They got here in plenty of time today. Uh, last week they uh, ran into some uh, traffic heading into Montgomery and only had about 45 minutes to get loose before the game. Here is Isaiah Bolden on the return. Bolden kicks it to the outside. Bolden out to midfield, and he'll be pushed out of bounds in Bethune-Cookman territory around the 40-yard line. That'll be a 55-yard return for Bolden. Wilkerson, their leading rusher. Some movement up front, free play here for Jackson State. They'll make the catch around the 25. That one goes to Daniels. He'll have plenty of yardage for the first down inside the 25 to the 23-yard line, a pickup of 14. The Pompano Beach area is Efer. Inside handoff, Wilkerson, he's to the five. A wall up there, but it'll be first and goal for Jackson State after a 16-yard run. Wilkerson goes in motion. Sanders looks over the middle. Touchdown, Jackson State. Rico Powers with his second touchdown catch of the year. And quickly, it's six to nothing, Jackson State. The air raid attack. Sanders, quick throw to the outside. Pass is caught there. Close to the first down by Rico Powers, who had that touchdown catch. Mets lost to Alabama A&M and Tennessee State in the two games after that victory. Here's Wilkerson. Boy, some good blocking on the outside. Frees him up to get into Bethune-Cookman territory down to the 35 as a helmet comes flying off. Another inside handoff, running hard, first down. Boy, some more collisions around the 21-yard line. Made him miss, and then he was able to pick up some positive yards. Quick snap, and that'll be a first down for Jackson State. They hit Rico Powers over the middle for their first touchdown. He'll go to the outside again, and this time it works with Dallas Daniels. Touchdown, Jackson State. Pass caught right over the middle. Willie Gaines. Spot route right over the football. Sanders, quick hitter. This one's caught by Dallas Daniels. Spins out of trouble. Hit around the 15-yard line and will fall down around the 13. He'll fake it to Wilkerson over the middle. Pass caught there. This will be another touchdown for Jackson State. Shane Hooks on the receiving end, and that didn't take very long. 13 yards and the third touchdown pass for Shadur Sanders. So fourth and 11. Jones. Pocket collapses, he throws a little bit low for Averett, trying to hit Kamari down over the middle, and that'll be a turnover on downs. Jackson State, four of eight on fourth downs this year. That one is incomplete. Boy, tried to throw a bullet right there between two Bethune-Cookman defenders. Oh, a high snap. That one's going to sail all the way into the end zone, and that will be a safety. So put two more points on the board now for Jackson State, and they'll get the football back. Four-man rush. Pass is caught. That'll be a first down and a whole bunch more as Hooks gets it inside the 40 down to the 36-yard line. Four-man rush. Sanders wide open at the 25-yard line, but backpedaling goes Shane Hooks, and he may have lost... Actually, they will, he actually, with his third effort, I guess. Handoff goes to Marshall. Oh, my goodness, what a hit at the five-yard line. Flags come in. Sanders looking, looking, has all day to throw, and that is wide open. Dallas Daniels in the back of the end zone. Jones kept it and dropped it, but falls on top of the football. Four-man rush, and they get to Jones in a hurry. So a couple of sacks today. This is a defense that finished second in the FCS last year, trying to improve on that. They get another sack. That's three of them now. Tough situation, slowing it down a little bit here. Sanders steps into this one. 
to the end zone. Under throws his man. It's picked off at the end zone. Sanders buying some time. Steps up. Heaves it way downfield and overthrew his receiver by 10 or 15 yards. And Ratliff comes up with the interception. Jones dropped. I mean, just doesn't have a chance to even look downfield. No, none of these routes are even able to, to kind of. Third down, they've been bringing pressure against you left or right. Looks like it's going to be zero here. Pocket collapses, and Jones just does. He lost the football. It's in the end zone. And the scramble still alive. They're going to call a safety. I don't know if he touched that line right there at the end. Right, the Jackson State. The ball State. was touched while the player was out of bounds. That's no one back. had possession of the ball. Last person in possession of the ball was Bethune Cookman, which results in the safety. Sanders, 27 of 37, 238. That handoff inside the 40. This will keep the clock moving under five minutes. Unfortunately, I have been in situations like that myself as far as you, you're just a vagabond, and here's another big run. Another, another big, another hit, big, big hit. hit. Yep. <laughs> so second down and two now. They'll hand it off. It's going to Marshall, and he slips through a seam and gets into the end zone for a touchdown. Nice catch around the 31-yard line. That one goes to Dylan Lee. The Third down and 10. Slides up into the pocket. Stops, throws, back over the middle. Pass is caught there. Lee gets it into the five-yard line. First and goal, Jones looks, throws. Back shoulder, caught. What a catch by the tight end, Kamari Averitt. Lee goes in motion. Now here's Jones, cuts it back. He'll try to get to the end zone, and he does. The two-point conversion works. There's a lot going on, a lot of movement, and that's what Coach Sanders was saying earlier. You know, they obviously, you want to get celebration ball, and that's another safety. The third safety. The third. I, I don't know that I've seen three safeties in the last three years, and I get three in one game. Yeah, one, one game, and that's just my quarterback not recognizing that's pressure off of the edge. And, Sanders trying to run for it. He'll cross midfield and he will get out of bounds around the 40 yard line. His best run. Dump it off to Marshall. Makes one man miss and he's inside the 35. I think that you feel good about where you are in this game, but. Man, I don't need my quarterback taking those types of hits. Hand it off there to Marshall. Stutter steps, first down, and then some. Already? It doesn't matter what. Right, I know what you're saying. Yeah, if, he, I, if he's banged up already, then I'm, I, I'm, not, I'm not worried about some of those other matchups as he throws another touchdown. I mean, you, you want him to get healthy as possible. I know you want the pitcher to look a lot better than what it is as far as efficiency is concerned. Side handoff that goes to Hunt again. Well, Jackson State's going to do something they haven't done since the 80s, and that's go 6 0 to start a season. Magic is back with Coach Sanders. I mean, the magic is definitely there with this team, and there's excitement across the con conference, there's excitement across the state and the city. And Coach Sanders with another W. So Jackson State comes to Jacksonville, puts on a show over 500 yards of offense. They put up 48 points and they beat Bethune Cookman for the second consecutive year. This time it's 48 to eight. And this handshake, a little different than last week.